This video will go over how to automate the Amazon Request or Review button functionality via FeedbackWiz. First, you would need to go into your Campaign Manager by selecting Campaigns tab and from the drop-down going to Campaign Manager. Once you're inside your Campaign Manager, you'll be able to see this green button, Create Amazon Review and Feedback Campaign. Go ahead and click into that. Once you click into that, you'll be able to see this option to create the campaign. You should note some of the following. The campaign will use Amazon's default email template for the review feedback request. This campaign is just like clicking on the request review button in Seller Central except fully automated. The request can only be scheduled between 5 to 30 days after order delivery. The request will not be sent if the buyer has already left a review or feedback. So the campaign name is already filled out for you, but you can go ahead and further edit this if you would like. The email template will be Amazon's official email template. You can click on the blue button to view how it will look like. This is just a sample preview. The store name, product item name, all of this data will reflect the appropriate information for your business. This is just a preview. The status, you would click active to go ahead and activate this. This is where you would select your marketplace. The label color is internal, so it is just for your reference if you would like to apply one. For target orders, you're able to target delivered orders. For the channel, you can select both FBA, FBM, or one or the other. For exclude orders, you have the following options for exclusions, such as seller feedback, promotions, returns, refunds, or delayed shipment. Underneath schedule is where you'll be able to select what time to send out the request and how many days after the order is delivered. You're able to choose anywhere between 5 to 30 days after order delivery. Underneath order matching rules is where you'll be able to choose which specific ASINs or SKUs to target or if you want to target all products. Underneath advanced options, you have the buyer's purchase count. This is the ability to target buyers based on how many times they have purchased from you. By default, all four of the check marks will be selected. You can click here for more information on this filter. Once everything is active up here, you can go ahead and click on this green button, Review and Save. When you click on the button, you'll be able to see this pop up. Go ahead and click on the green button, Create Campaign. So now you'll be able to see that this Amazon review and feedback request, the new one that we just created, is active and you'll be able to track how many emails you've sent, which ones will be queued, and you can always click into the action button as well to go ahead and edit the campaign or preview it as well. So for the preview, this is going to be the official Amazon template that will be sent to all of your buyers. This template will autofill all of the appropriate data for your company, such as the store name, the product item name. It will also populate your product image as well. This is just a sample preview, and this is how to set up the requester review button functionality via feedback quiz. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel, and for more information, please visit feedbackwiz.com.